<laughs> Welcome back everybody. So I was doing shopping today and I found the perfect, perfect prank for your holiday season. The security door or the security bar is insanely funny to me. Cause in my head, I imagine whoever created this thought like, you know, no one wants to break into your house. Just put a security bar there. Don't worry about it. You can sleep through the night. But he didn't think about me. You see, what if you were going to work, right? Five o'clock in the morning, you're about to wake up, rise and grind, and you go out there and next thing you know, you can't open your door. You, you move it a couple times, you're like, Boom. all right, uh, something must be in the way. Boom. All right, something's definitely in the way. Boom. I can't leave my house? Like, <laughs> you're stuck. And imagine even better. Imagine if you're on the third floor. Now you're thinking, I can't call nobody. I gotta scream for help, but people are probably asleep. <sighs> then you look outside, you see your three-story drop, and you're like, eh, I gotta make that jump. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm gonna be late for work, and I'm gonna get fired. <laughs> it's just so evil. So if any of you guys ever feel like to play the perfect prank on someone this holiday season, get yourself a security bar just a security bar. It's $20, really inexpensive, and you can just make someone's day. In fact, the best way to do this is, of course, putting it on your neighbor's door that you can see from a good distance and just enjoy the show because they can't get out. <laughs> They're just stuck. Plus, imagine how mad you would be if that happened. Could you imagine? You did all that, jump from your third story building, walk all the way up those stairs again, just to see Someone put a security bar in front of your door? <laughs> oh man, please tell me how mad you guys would be if you saw that. Anyways, that's it. Thought I should share. I'll see you guys next time.